From Hot Food Stores and Pharmacies. First time tonight, call welcome to David Tatt. Thank you, Andy. Energon. Modified this certainly year, a category of speedway that have been going ahead in leaps and bounds at this venue right throughout the summer. And just ahead of Holly Dunn, the three days satellite Plenty of numbers. Fine, warm and sunny days ahead, light winds with afternoon coastal sea And starting from Paul in car 44 will be Russell Bradley. The outlook for Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Outside of him Five is John Robbins. Car zero, degrees. Tony no, Hobby, certainly the man to watch in this one. Not too far away in the third row on the inside. We're going to see the green flag as they work their way towards the main straightaway and best to begin in car 45 on the extreme outside. Plenty of action there. In car 16, Kevin Birch it was. Got all, all crossed up. Managed to get the four wheels back on the racetrack and heads down the back straight. In fact, it's going quicker if anything at the moment. Race leader though, John Robbins as they come down the main section. Yellow flag is out. Car 54, which is Barry Bundy, is in a rather dangerous position. Stuck on the bank there on the entry to turn one, so they'll come back and do it all over again. Could have been a lot worse, that one. Could have been a lot. Yeah, Roland's one of the, the mainstays of this division. And whilst he's starting right at the back of the field, can certainly not be written off as far as his podium prospects are concerned. Car 45 certainly began very quickly when they saw the green flag. John Robbins, he'll be looking to repeat that. Shouldn't be long now before we have a race restart. Six laps the journey in the first event for Modifieds on the program under clear blue skies, magnificent weather conditions. Speedway, a very handy crowd now into the venue. Arthur Cowan should wave the green flag this time round as the field now four off turn four and head down the main section and once again... ...is right around the outside and continues where he left off last night at the Newcastle venue and Tony Hopping with now one lap completed has already opened up a gap of about 15 metres Next best was in uh, car 45, in fact he was swamped on the outside by in car 61. Moving very quickly there, don't know the driver there or do we? Yes we do, it's Mick Turner all the way from Newcastle. Having some handling problems with that modified at the moment. Look at the, the pace that Hopping in the zero car up front is setting at the moment. A cracking pace as he heads down the back section now about 15 to 20 metres in advance of his nearest rival. Certainly looks good uh, and a lot better than the numbers. Car, I believe it is from Newcastle, Dave Bryan. Bryan is flying a hell of a lot of smoke out the back of his uh, modified as he heads down into terms of number three and four. Tony Hobby, no absolute sensation the zero car. Stamping his authority on the modified division uh, very early in the piece tonight. And Paul Rolls is another guy spewing out uh, smoke. Dito heads for the pits. The other guy at 65, Brian, quite content to stay where he is. The rate of attrition so far is the other guys have had to leave the circuit. About three quarters of a lap remaining until the chequered flag. Tony Hopping is the race leader coming up on some of the other cars and only something very, very drastic will uh, rob him of winning this one. Oh, and it almost did, but the chequered flag goes out to Tony Hopping. You can bet your bottom dollar you'll see him in the winner's circle again a little later tonight. I think it was car number 61 second, that was uh, Mickey Turner from Newcastle. Car 45, John Robbins rounding out the top three in official time.